vehicle anywhere in service today. So if you look just how close our two vehicles are getting next to each other, there's maybe a couple of foot between those two. We've got Andrew on the outside and Mick on the inside. They're just warming their engines up, warming up those gearboxes. Now the gearboxes on these very interesting in the fact that you could change gear both going forward and also going backwards as well. They're very low on the on the three feet four. They're going to go back right and we're 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 going to go Now when we did this last year, it hadn't rained for about two weeks, so it's just an all sorts being thrown up into the face of Nick to barely see where he was going, while Andrew was flying around the reverse. You can hear them down shifting, down shifting in reverse while we're clicking the apex. Oh, 
the can. Here we go, Andrew's going to go over the obstacle course. You saw the scamble to this earlier. Just look how low down they go. Getting the power down. This is first gear crawling up. That's literally sky from his perspective now. And Seesaw, here we go. Whoa, up and over. Down he goes. These are still one of the most predictable, most dynamic, fastest tanks in the world anywhere today. Getting the power down, using the gearbox, using the torque on that diesel engine. We're going to go down again. Got that tank in the road. Off and over it goes. Look at the wheel on the tank. Ladies and gents, please put your hands together for our two drivers, Mick and Andrew, and the Alvin, Mikey, Nichols, Percy.